Harmonic Bionics is a robotics company focused on enhancing rehabilitation therapy through automation, dynamic data capture, and connectivity. Our goal at Harmonic Bionics is to create technology that augments the therapist in order to achieve optimal results. As the population ages, we're seeing more and more neurological injuries um, and strokes in the country. Right now, there are somewhere between eight to nine million stroke survivors living in the U.S. alone, which is a good thing because that means more stroke survivors are surviving the stroke, but it also means that there are millions of people in this country that are living with impairments from those strokes. Unfortunately, neuro recovery is very labor intensive. Um, there are not enough therapists in the country to take care of all of those patients. Robotics and technology can alleviate some of this labor intensive um, therapy. We are inventing a new type of robotics technology. Traditionally, the robotics in factory environment is a very fast, strong, but it is dangerous, so it works only in a caged environment. But our robot always interacts with the human body. To make it possible, we had to invent a new mechanical electrical software components, and some of the all this new technology is Harmon SHR. There's less research, less technology development on the side of upper body, and that's because arm and hand control is quite complicated. There weren't any technological advances happening on that specific direction, so we thought let's focus on that problem. With the richness of data that, that Harmony SHR sensors bring and their fidelity and accuracy, Harmony could be a window into the actual behavior or performance of the human nervous system and the human neuromuscular system. So I think the problem with our clinical assessment right now is some of it is somewhat subjective. If we are able to get devices such as the Harmony into more uh, centers across the U.S., I think it will allow clinicians to gather a lot of data that we typically don't have access to. So the force generated at a joint, um, the actual range of motion or the joint angles in a particular uh, point in time. Never had a patient who has been in the Harmony device complain that they're tired of the therapy, they actually want more. I have a wait list of people who are just dying to get back on the device right now. In addition to being a therapy tool today, it can, is also a research tool for therapies for tomorrow. So I'm working with uh, researchers from all over the U.S., top neuroscientists, top rehab doctors, to explore how uh, we can understand how the brain is recovering. We can even create predictive models of like if person A comes in, we know their demographics, their age, um, their comorbidities, and we can hopefully predict how well they, they're going to recover, and based on that, we can tailor treatment for them. A lot of this information will kind of transform the way we kind of practice medicine and how our therapists are able to tailor their uh, therapies specifically for this patient and seeing in real time how the patient's muscles and joints are improving.